Are you looking for the best 3D printers? In this video, we will look at some of the 4 best 3D printers on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Elegoo Saturn 28K. Elegoo is known for its consistently high-performing yet affordable MSLA 3D printers named after planets, such as the Jupiter, Mars, and Saturn series. Pluto series probably not coming anytime soon. The Saturn 28K is an MSLA 3D printer with a 10-inch 8K LCD. Yep, higher screen resolution than my laptop or TV. And like its namesake, it's pretty big, it has a sizable build volume of 219 by 123 by 250 millimeters, perfect for building large models with strikingly sharp detail. So if you want some of the most realistic detail in 3D printing, whether for game figurines or miniature models, this 3D printer is ideal for you. It delivers this level of detail thanks to its 48 UV LED lights and a Fresnel lens that work together to create a light beam with a wavelength of 405 nanometers. This yields amazing printing accuracy and a smoother surface finish. When printing with resin, you have to consider the fumes, which can be hazardous if breathed for long periods of time in a closed environment. Elego took this into consideration and added an activated carbon air filter to the Saturn 28K which reduces odor when printing. Pretty neat and it does reduce the awful odor to a large degree, but doesn't fully eliminate it. Another nifty feature was the two-bolt build plate leveling. It's a super simple process that makes it easy for beginners to level the bed and get started printing. Now let's talk about speed. When you print resin, it's usually painfully slow and that's all because of the UV curing process. That's why FDM 3D printers are preferred for occasions that require speedy printing. With the Saturn 28K though, you get a cure time of just 1 to 3 seconds per layer, which is fast compared to some resin 3D printers on the market with speeds rivaling that of a tortoise. This 3D printer is built to last, coming with a sturdy Z-axis with dual linear rails and non-slip hexagon socket leveling screws. This setup helps to keep the printer working accurately and steadily. And at this price point, it's something pretty great. It also has a scratch-resistant glass of 9H hardness above the LCD. This is really useful because accidents do happen and if you accidentally spill resin on the LCD, you might as well open Amazon and order a new one right then and there. At Number 2. Chidi Tech X Max. The Chidi Tech X Max is an enclosed 3D printer with a build volume of a whopping 300 by 250 by 300 mm, the largest on this list. And it doesn't sacrifice quality either, printing at 0.05 mm which yields crisp, accurate detail. The X-Max comes with two extruders, one for printing your standard run-of-the-mill PLA, ABS, and similar filaments, and another extruder for high-temperature filaments such as PC and nylon. Its maximum extrusion temperature is a very toasty 300 degrees Celsius, while its heated print bed can go up to temperatures of 120 degrees Celsius. And with the enclosure plus the high temperature of the heated print bed, you can print ABS, which usually is prone to warping like an overcooked omelet when printed in an open environment. The enclosure is also really handy for safety reasons so if you have kids, students, or animals this printer is perfect for you. The Chidi Tech X Max is a really sturdy printer that, unlike some others, doesn't wobble or vibrate while printing at all thanks to its dual Z-axis support. This lack of wobbling not only reduces noise, this printer's at about the 50 dB level, which is barely audible, but also keeps your prints looking super smooth and accurate. The X-Max is also particularly suitable if you need to churn out prints that look the same. So if you want to make a million Nicolas Cage figurines that all look exactly the same, this is the printer for you. And that is a commendable mission to embark on, so we applaud you. With an accuracy of 0.01 mm, you'll get pretty much the same results every time, so it's perfect for production. Unfortunately, the X-Max doesn't have automatic bed leveling, but the build is so stable, you won't even need to level the bed often. After your initial leveling, you'll find that the machine stays put and this really sets it apart from other printers where you have to constantly level the bed. And prints can really go haywire when the bed isn't leveled properly, so you won't run into that issue with the X-Max. 
Also, keep in mind that while this printer comes with two extruders, it doesn't actually support dual extrusion, bummer. So that means you can only work with one filament at a time. Note, if you want the ability to print with multiple colors, check out our article on the best multicolor 3D printers. And the price of the XMAX, although pretty reasonable for its sturdy build and consistently excellent printing performance, can be a bit too expensive for some budgets. At Number 3. Flashforge Adventurer 4. The Adventurer 4 has a flexible and removable print bed, which makes removing your print easy and hassle-free. And it comes with a second print bed in case you want to start printing another object immediately. Also, the printer's design is made to ensure it lasts a long time. For example, unlike some printers, the filament reel isn't totally exposed, instead there's a small door that covers the filament reel, protecting it from moisture and outside elements. Now, a very unique feature that most 3D printers don't have, the Adventurer 4 comes with four swappable nozzles. Very apt! You get two 0.4mm nozzles, a 0.3mm nozzle, and a 0.6mm nozzle. This gives you a lot of flexibility to experiment with different materials and extrusion speeds. One of the 0.4mm nozzles works at 240 degrees Celsius, and the other at 265 degrees Celsius for materials that require higher temperatures, such as PC and nylon. The nozzle diameter plays a huge part in the overall print speed. With a bigger nozzle diameter, more filament can come out, and therefore you can print stuff faster. But you'll have to make sacrifices in print quality. It also has a small fan at the back end fitted with a HEPA filter to remove odor particles from the printing environment. The Adventurer 4 also comes with a camera. We like the idea, but the lighting inside the 3D printer was so dim, we could barely make anything out. The footage was also grainy, it felt like watching a 2009 YouTube video. This flaw should definitely be fixed in future iterations of this printer. At Number 4. Anycubic Photon M3 Premium. The second 8K resin 3D printer on this list, the Anycubic Photon M3 Premium puts out some amazingly detailed prints. With its light turbo 2.0 feature and 8K screen, the UV has no trouble spreading uniformly across the LCD and reduces any stray light that could potentially mess up your print. So if you want the best looking prints you can get, you'd be hard pressed to find something better in this price range than the Photon M3 Premium. It's the best 3D printer under 1000 in the resin category. This is a resin printer with a pretty large build volume of 250 by 123 by 219 millimeters. It has a huge resin vat at 1.35L, which means you don't have to refill it as often. Refilling resin can be a huge hassle, especially if you're already in the middle of a print. Also, with this printer, Anycubic added in a new feature that's not present in the other Photon M3 printers, the Premium comes with two built-in air purifiers, which is very handy when printing resin. This will reduce the nasty smell which often starts to leak out when you're printing resin, and might make your neighbors think something very suspicious is happening in your house. Thanks to its Wi-Fi and cloud capabilities, you can easily send files to your 3D printer. This is a really handy feature not present in the Yelagu Saturn 28K, so if you prefer Wi-Fi enabled printers, go for the Photon M3 Premium. The build plate is made of laser carved metal and the LCD screen is monochrome. The Photon M3 Premium comes with a 4.3 touchscreen for easy navigation and has a type A USB port. It also supports Wi-Fi, so you can transfer files from your phone and computer. Sadly, this printer doesn't have automatic bed leveling, it has a four-point manual leveling system that requires you to level the bed with a piece of paper or card. The software, Photon Workshop, is pretty decent. However, do keep in mind that it can put way more supports than necessary, which can sometimes ruin prints. Make sure to adjust this setting beforehand. 